and to go get some new year. It's the only thing in my fucking care package. My fucking lifeline. What made him go oh. to the Fusey? Huh. What made him go to the Fusey? Uh, I can't remember. We ain't got the argument. And then. That nigga got off. <laughs> made the nigga go to Madden. And then shit. Who? Uh, oh, Will? Nah, me, I might. Yeah. Nigga yeah. got the argument. I forgot about it. I forgot who he was on before that. I sent me that boy on that Mad Maggie tip. Not the Mad Maggie, but the. He back on Val. I'll put that nigga back on Val. <sighs> Who the hell? Josh was running somebody else before. <sighs> He's on somebody and then and nigga. It's a fusion. Well, this defense for the Seahawks terrific last week in the season opening victory. And no matter what's done throughout a ball game, it always comes back to Why is D Boy Samuels number eight? But I think it's hard for people to understand just how difficult it is to tackle, especially open field. Very few missed tackles on tape that I saw last game. Who oh, has gotta be a pig? Come on, man. This one is incomplete. He was trying to get it to George Kittle. Yo, lead. brother. But now it'll be third down. Yeah. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> oh, they didn't let me catch the... Bro, they didn't let me catch the pig, bro. I don't know. I don't know. situation like this, you have to think about your tight end, and he comes through for him, picking up the first down. They gotta let me have that, though. No, sir. Just Jamal. <laughs> That's Jamal. Come on, man. You know better than that. I like the idea to mix it up from time to time, because let's face it, you can't be predictable. Come on, man. You know better than that. So their task a little bit more difficult now. Second and 13 that they're walking up on. Off of play action. Here's Lance. Go get him. Seeing nowhere to throw. He chucks this one away from harm. Incomplete. Now it's third down. Oh, I saw this one with defensive eyes because even as he escaped the pocket and bought time, the coverage stayed tight. Nothing broke down. Throwing it away, that was his only option. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means he'll need to come up with something here on third down. On play action, Lance. That, they've been not called a penalty. Roughing the passer, bro. Wow, they getting down on me. But it adds a little extra to it when it comes on third down. Certainly does because if this were a boxing match, they had him on the ropes there. Third down incompletion, fourth down upcoming. Instead, that mistake resets everything back to first down. Which means they have to stay on the They getting down on me, brother. And they're gonna get this down inside the twenty. Oh, it's time to give a little credit there to the defense. They played that very well because it was a drag route, and he ran a little shallower than normal as he worked straight across the field. He was hoping he'd get lost behind the defensive line, but once he made the catch, nowhere to turn up field and gain any yardage. And he'll get this one down to about the 17. Come on, man. Three yards is half of what they needed. Now can they get the other three here on third down? Just not a whole lot of room to operate there on that carry. No, not at all. They did a really nice job staying in their proper places and not allowing any lanes to open up. <sighs> and this will be play number eight of the opening drive. It's third and short. Oh, third down. Here's Mitchell. Oh, he ran it. 
Hang on, that's all. Oh yeah, sorry, guess what? What's that? Got some heirloom shards yesterday, nigga. What? Yeah, nigga. Open a two pass and go. Why my team showing like this though, bro? He don't know what to get though, bro. Bring it back, bro. Alright. I kinda wanna wait for Ash to get her air long. Cause if Why my team doing that? Oh, probably the race shit. That's like that stick you, you see the uh high back run around with. Yeah. I finally got them holes, man. I'm playing real game. Goddamn, since some motherfucker came out. Jamal! Oh, they wouldn't let me get busy. They wouldn't let me get busy. Jamal! Oh, he told me up. This could cost him. They'll get this out wide to Metcalf. Come on, Metcalf. They'll go for a gain of seven. Get loose. Oh, yeah, it's much more fun, too. You get a better experience. Mm-hmm. Walker. Walker. Maybe fumbling like that. You gotta lead him, bro. He gotta lead him, bro. Oh, he tried to punch it out, too. Yikes. Make sure to punch that out on me. So they just Oh, why he do that? No, why he didn't? I thought I ran inside zone, bro. I didn't know I did that. I thought I ran inside zone. Ah, uh, I blew that. I blew that one. Yeah, he ain't in this formation. I need you on. Bro, what is happening, bro? Why are my team out of whack like this, bro? Mmm, I think I just did. I did both. I did both of those things, bro. Neither one of them working. There you go. Now they're good. I'm tired of this Mitchell guy, bro. I'm tired of him. He, he's the best running back on this game. Hey. Tearing us up, brother. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. Up to three. Hey. On first down, they go back to Mitchell. Mm. And he'll get a few yards here to the 34. The Niners had Owen. Hey, he switched that. He switched that play quick. I didn't even see him switch down. They knew last week they went for a tough fight on the road. But now, here's 
was the home opener and a chance to get things right. And I like the way that you presented that because the bottom line is they didn't come out that loss discouraged. They just came home and said, hey, Yeah, get it out. Get it out. We'll be just fine. A second down pass play there, but it's incomplete. That was not a real confident throw right there, and he's just two of seven to start the game. Now he's going to have to find a groove with a big third down coming up. Let's see if his confidence can increase. Lance looking to throw it. Oh, yes, sir. I know what you're locking on to. I know what you're locking on to. Not the way you want to start when you're coming off of a loss last week. Every team talks about starting fast. They're hoping on their next possession, it can be a delayed fast start and get them going. Wisnowski on to punt as he sends this one away. And the fair catch. <laughs> yeah, fair catch there. The I have no problem with fair catching him. Yards on the punt there, no return. And it'll be Seahawk football first and ten. Coming to the line here to begin their next drive, the Seahawks offense. Early on, you know, Charles, every game could be called a measuring stick game, but I think when it comes within your division, mm -hmm. it's, it's a good throw, baby. Stick game with a little extra injury. I would agree with that totally. Good throw, baby. Division games have a little extra to them. But I'm going to on it. Situated because at this stage of the season, it has that little extra juice, but at the same time, it's not. Yeah, Huntley going to be my quarterback. I think. Week 15, 16, somewhere in that neighborhood. Only gonna be my QB, man. Nah, he a normal. He's gonna keep this again. Oh, then his safety can't make that play. That man, safety came screaming down here. You gotta know. Defenders, if they get a free shot at the QB, they want to take it and they want to take it big. And they got it there on the option play for a loss. And it looks like we've got a dime set here defensively. Six DBs in the game. Oh, no. Why'd he come all the way across the field? There you go, Huntley. Good, good throw, baby. I can win with that. How do you hit stick me? <laughs> How do you hit stick me, man? How do you hit stick me in there? Oh my gosh. I don't know if I can go for this or not. Let me check and see. Oh, okay. All right, we got to be able to get this, bro. I should have ran it on third down. What am I thinking? Oh no, don't fall. And he is going to have a 
a Seahawks first down as they manage to convert, and that'll keep the drive alive. They're able to keep Don't fall, brother. Seven yards that time, and the decision to go for it proves to be a good one. Bro, block him, man. Block him. I really ain't asking for that much, though. Oh, block this dude, bro. Ooh, my team. My team, my team, my team. Let's see what our referee says. Come on, man. You got to block them guys. Oh no. Oh his defense is on my head, boy. Alright, we don't have to get it all back here. We don't have to get it all back. Two minutes on the clock and what's been We need ten yards. He leaving one on one. I'm throwing this fade to Metcalf. Tell you that right now. Let's get it. Huh, Tyler Huntley. But they allow the conversion. So the big play means just like that. They'll operate from the red zone now on first down. I know, I know he gonna block. <laughs> I know DK gonna block. Come on, Walker. Get in the end zone, son. Seven yards on the pick up there, and now they've got it first and goal. This is a very impressive drive, especially when you consider where they started from to now be set up first and goal. Yeah, it's a nice running right there. That's what got them the first down. But at this point, I suggest open up your playbook. You can call just about what you want. Now, here's a little touch pass. Good block, son. Good block. Good block, son. What a drive. What a freaking drive. Nah, brother. They like this formation. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Why everybody like running this formation? Everybody like running that formation. Ah, I'm on the wrong guy. I'm on the wrong guy. Big set, a big D tackle. <laughs> Come on, man. Yeah, they run. They, every time they go that formation, I'm going man, bro. Yeah, they go that tray. I'm going man, brother. Oh, where'd my middle guy go? Where'd he go? Bunch wide. Yeah, oh, pick it off, son. Pick it off. 
as the clock will stop with 20 seconds to go in the first half. One thing you're hoping for when you run drag routes, you're able to hit a receiver in stride and you can pick up a lot of yardage after the catch. But in this situation, the defense was effective, able to stop him before you get a good head. Oh, give me a bounce. Clock running. Clock running. Seahawks, they're out in front as we send you cross country to Orlando. Jonathan Coachman is there and has our EA Sports halftime report. Both these teams, no doubt, making their final halftime adjustments as we speak. And for the call of the second half, we get it back out to Brandon Gunn and Charles. Can Taylor. we get DK involved in this game, bro? I'm trying, man. I'm trying. See, I throw him a little snap. The Seahawks with the advantage, and they get the football first as the second half is underway. And that'll carry over. Yeah, I don't even have to play online no more. Drive the Seahawks offense. Their defense has pitched the shutout. Now they probably need to deliver a little breathing room, maybe make it a two score game as they've got it first and ten. Ooh, I want that working magic in that pocket. Slides to a hole. He'll get three yards on the scramble there at second down. I certainly like what he did right there because he smartly wanted to avoid forcing anything downfield because nothing appeared to be open. Nice harmless slide there to avoid the big hit. And he gets a small gain on the play. Bro, he will not block him. The result only four yards there on the play. And that'll leave him with a third and two. Okay, make a play, son. Make a play. One on one. First and ten. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. Now this game, it has obviously been all about the defense on both sides of the football. Which offense is get it out? We'll see if they can do it on this drive. Get it out. Throwing on first down, but this one winds up to be incomplete. Another attempt, another incompletion, and when I look at the scoreboard and where we are in this game, it comes to mind that they have to start getting the ball in the hands of their playmakers. Throw it to the guys that maybe can take a short pass and turn it into Ooh, he almost cribbed that run and I blitzed right up the middle. And the guys who can put the ball in the end zone, they're the ones that need to touch the ball. They get six, that'll leave them with third and four. In search of four yards here to pick up the first down. Now Lance. Oh, Adams. <laughs> Jamal. Jamal. Hey. I gotta get Jamal a sack now. I gotta get him a sack now. Six, they'll get another shot at it now as this one's in the air. 
takes it at the seven. A solid 12-yard return after the 55-yard punt. And it will be first and 10 as they take over. Coming to the line here to begin their next drive, the Seahawks offense. This crew had to punt last time they had the ball, but when you've got a lead like this, you can tend to play the field position game. You are to an extent, especially if you like your defense, because you have the lead, you've been controlling the game. But why put them in a tougher spot? You want to get out there and get something done on offense and maybe take command of this game yourself. A good gain on first has him set up with second and just a couple of inches now from the 29. Sticking with Walker on second down. Second and inches is oftentimes an invitation for an offense coordinator to take a big shot downfield because he feels like he can come back on third down and pick up the first down. But sometimes you just don't want to break tendency. Stay with what you are. Stay with who you know and go get the first down. That's exactly what they did. A nice burst there as he'll get about seven that time on the first down run. Well, you certainly have to give a little credit here because they're playing this game now at their pace. This is ball control football, sustained runs, taking their time, and making it work. On second down, here's Penny. And this will be a Seahawks first down as good running gets him to about the 44. I think they like this drive a little bit better there, partner. Running game helping out, picking up some of the slack. Because remember the last drive, they went three and out. Walker now on first and 10. And down to the 36-yard line here. A nice run there, nine yards, and it'll be second down. And there we saw one of the downsides of blitzing during a rundown because sometimes you get out of your gaps. You don't fit the run quite as well because you're headed towards the ball carrier with abandon. Now they'll switch it up here and look to throw. And this one is incomplete. The touch and time are critical for those types of throws. He put a lot of zip on that one. Needed just a little bit more finesse trying to get it to his back. This will be play number seven on the drive. Third and a yard. Ready. He gets it to his running back, Rashad Penny. Oh, he's got a little daylight. And he is out of bounds right around the 10-yard line. Well, that's one way to convert on third down, picking up 26 yards. And now we get into the psychology of the whole thing because a lot of teams with a two-score lead in the third quarter, they almost become defensive with their offense, just playing there not to go, lose. Pat. I think with this team, you got to figure at this point, this is a great spot for them to go into attack mode, really try to put the hammer down and finish this one off. going to get to the line to run another play. So we will switch ends as the third quarter has come to a close. You are watching the NFL on EA Sports. Ready, 
So not quite a first and goal. It's first and 10 from the 10. Back to throw. Huntley. And this will be caught by Metcalf for a Seahawk touchdown. A great effort there. His second touchdown on the season. And the Seahawks are looking to make it two straight as they add on to this fourth quarter lead. Hey, man, don't play with DK. Don't play with Metcalf in the red zone, bro. You see that? The kick unit for the Seahawks out there on the field, and we are ready to rock. You gonna leave me over there one on one with the bum? It's out of the back of the end zone for a touchback. Come on, bro. We man this formation up, bro. We know y'all like this formation. We man this one up, bro. I said, play man inside. Thank you. Uh. With the bums. Hand it off, son. Oh. I think every player in the NFL would want to come back from injury, as Nick Bosa did last season. Fifteen and a half sacks, fourth in the NFL after playing in only two. I'm going DK. I'm going to DK. Due to a knee injury. He's gonna let this go. Back of the end zone. Come on, DK. Make a play, son. DK couldn't make a play for me right there, brother. This offense so far on third down. They've hit four of seven. This is third and 14. He'll find Metcalf. Oh, he made one right there, though. Oh, he made one right there, though. Five yard line. A pretty good mark there. They needed 14. They got 14 on third down. Looked like the defense put pretty good pressure on him, but he's able to flush out to his right to try and evade people. On the run, had to get on his horse. Still accurately throws a nice pass for a first down. DK! <laughs> Moss him! I think it's fairly safe to call this game over, but they're still trying to bomb it downfield and add to their lead. Almost makes you start to feel for the defense and root for them a little bit, too. Straight ahead, Walker. Mm, you can't punch it down on us, brother. Oh yeah. I like little Eskridge. He gonna leave him one on one again, bro. All right, here we go. Ooh. He's supposed to get loose. I like I like when people blitz me. Yeah, I throw my little check down. I ain't got no problem with it. They become just as critical to the passing attack as a lot of receivers, tight ends, because their ability to make people miss in the open field can really generate big plays for an offense. To throw on second down, Huntley. Come on, it's Metcalf! It's Metcalf, bro. Stop leaving him on the island with Ward over there. It's Metcalf, bro. Yeah. 
I throw it high with L1. Throw it high, only my guy can get it. Yeah, come on, man. Come on, bro. <laughs> you seen that? Solid way to start the drive. 13 yards, picking up the first. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Throwing now is Lance. I told y'all to be in the flats. I told y'all to be in the flats hard. You gotta get you another one. Adams, you gotta get you another one. Thus far, no touchdown passes, no points for his team, but he remains undaunted. Still attempting to get his team on the scoreboard, firing the ball downfield. Get in there, big fellas. Oh no, you're not running past him. You're not running past Wooten. <laughs> Come on, brother. That's 6497 speed. You ain't running past him. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We're getting busy. Bro, this is disrespectful to DK Metcalf. Now it looks like he'll throw here. That's disrespectful. <laughs> that is disrespectful to DK. Uh, I just throw it up high. I just throw it up high and let him go get it. I don't try to do nothing fancy. I just throw it up high. I'm going to get it. He got the babies on him. Yeah, I got include chat, Inclu include voice chat. Crazy, it's call time right now. The last run, good for two. Here's second and eight. The Lance gonna throw. Yes, sir. Get him down. Talk about two sides of the ball across purposes because mercifully this game's almost over for the offense, but the defense they still want to get a few shots in. We're going crazy in score time right now. I've been in score time the whole game. They've been able to pad their stats, and maybe some backups can get in and get a sack as well. Oh yeah, Kobe. Get loose, Kobe. Nah, it's second. And the big fella stuffed that one up in a big way. I think doubling him has to be a priority because you can't mm, just get to about. the next level if you don't take care of him first. Sticking with Walker on second down. They follow up the gain of two mm. with a gain of one that time. Mm. 
Alright, I put it I put a stop to him. I put a stop to Elijah Mitchell for you, bro. That's about as big and clean of a win as you could hope for in the National Football League. No turnovers. While you, meanwhile, you forced turnovers. You didn't allow any points, and you put up a bunch of points. What an effort. And Brandon, I just have to what a complete show. Those are statistics.